Hi everybody, welcome to my channel and thanks for watching my videos. Today we will prepare a homemade chicken liver pate. So for this we need chicken liver, butter, some sugar, I use the light brown, some salt, I use the sea salt, some coriander, some jam, strawberry jam, uh, thyme, fresh thyme, red wine, and olive oil, and uh, actually I forget, uh, it's a garlic as well, so I have it in the fridge. So we can start preparing. We need to do the first the base. Liver is on the end. So again, I forget. We need as well onion because we're gonna cook first the base, which will be onion, garlic, thyme, jam, coriander, some salt, red wine, and and that's it. So we need to cook it and reduce, and then we will mix it with the roasted uh, roasted liver. Don't forget about the butter. Butter can't be melted. Butter has to be butter has to be room temperature soft because it once it will be melted your pate will be split will split it so it will not work it out so start so as you can see you can you can cut the onion and garlic in in many different ways doesn't has to be fine because on the end it will be everything blitz together so just cut it and cook it that's it so we're gonna just let sweat the onion, put some salt and let's cook it. A little bit sugar, get a little bit kind of oil. So we don't have to do anything more just right now. So I put a little bit some springs of thyme inside because it will give nice flavor, nice taste. And then we just basically take take the spring out before we blend it. So the thyme will stay inside of the flavor and everything. So We put some coriander and the wine. And we will put some jam and let's just cook the onion off. That's it. And let it, let it reduce. So I put something like this on the strawberry jam. You can use red currant jam, strawberry jam, any different homemade jam. It's everything up to you. Just you need to now cook it slowly. You can put apples inside as well. You can put orange. Just cook it, you know, slowly because it will get the, get the taste of the fruity. And chicken liver, it's nice with fruits, you know, it's nice. So as you can see, now we can't see, so you can see, it's almost reduced, we need, we need a little bit more, and it tastes nice, everything is nice, so we just, you can season it, you know, if you need more sugar a little bit, if you need more salt, you know, you have to do it by your taste, so, so it's now ready. I will show you. See how thick it is? It's nice. It's like a sauce. So, wow, the taste is strong. It's nice. So, we can switch it off. Just like cool. Okay, <clears throat> so we have the oil inside, and we will just put the liver inside, sweat it, doesn't have to be cooked through properly, you know, because original 
pata has to be pink, so liver has to be pink to get a, keep the color. But for you, if you like cook properly through the liver, you can just cook it well done. It has to do everything because it will be stay at home anyway. And you don't have to be afraid to season the liver. People are, you know, we are, we are heard hearing that the liver become seasoned by salt before cooking or during the cooking because it will stay tough. No, this is not true. The liver will cook itself again, so it will soft keep it soft in another way. So, so we just sweat it. Then we will play separate bowl and blend it with mustard butter and the uh, reduction of the onion and everything. So we continue. It looks like this. You can still you see the juice on the bottom. So almost done. And then it will start like to liquid and prepare it finished. So the liver is done, as you can see. Now we have here the reduction. So we will put everything inside. And butter, butter is very important. You have to go slowly, you know, like a spoon by spoon. Don't put everything in because it can split. It doesn't have to be melted, it has to be room temperature. So, so Pate is done. As you can see, not split, nothing. Perfect. We put like maybe one and a half of the butter. Tastes perfect. Once you are blended, you can put it on more salt, more spicy, or you can put even chili or something inside if you like. You know, it's everything up to you. And one more thing. If you make this big measure, like me, big batch, you have to leave it everything in the fridge. You can leave in the fridge the amount what you like it, and the rest you can split it in bags or plastic containers and freeze it. And then you will just take it out, and it will be perfectly the same. Maybe you just need to mix it a bit. Thank you very much for watching my videos. Stay tuned for more videos. Please. See it's nice. And if you want to put in the form, you can put in the form, and on the top you can melt a little bit of butter and put it on the top of the butter. So if the butter will keep it fresh, it will not put any, it will not let inside any, any air or anything. So, okay. mm. delicious. Thank you very much for watching my channel again. Please subscribe to my channel and stay tuned for more videos. If you have any questions about this preparation of the chicken liver pate, Write it below in the comments and I will answer it. Thank you.